So what we have here is the real link E1 Pro. So Real Link representative actually contacted me to see whether I'll be interested to review their products. I mean, they are uh, specializing in smart home security cameras and they got uh, various uh, products available. I like uh, Real, Real Link Go that you can actually mount it either on your tree on their website. This is a 4G LTE um, battery camera. There's the RLC hyphen 520 which is 5 megapixel security ip camera as well there's rlc 5100 um, there's 410 as well and also the uh, solar power panel that you could actually provide power source to your security camera so they seem to have a very good website and good review on the youtube as well so the reason i actually requested the e1 pro is more a domestic use purpose that i just thought quite a lot of people will be interested at and something that we definitely need on our household as well. So to um, highlight about this feature about this camera is that it provides a four megapixel video unlike the most conventional, uh, the security camera, indoor security camera that provides the uh, 1080p quality and also uh, can actually be connected either to 2.4 or the 5 gigahertz wi-fi connection so it gives more advanced for feeding all the data source as well so let's in, let's actually um, do the unboxing of real links so here it goes so it's a ce declaration of conformity be prepared be real link so inside here, the real link 24 hour video surveillance. This is a, oh right, so there's about three sets of, oh, no actually, five sets of stickers. Quick start guidance. So I'm sure you could actually go through that. What we have here is a the UK power friendly socket, European uh, wall mounted option if you want, and that's the bracket. Pretty simple. And lastly, oh, sorry, anything else? No, that's the last piece. Let's take it out. Sticker attached to it as well, and um, a bit of weight. Good, good weight, enough weight has real link on it. So let's peel it out. And I'm already aware of that if you drag it up, there's where the memory card you can put in and the reset button on it as well. Can you see that reset button? And it could move around. The way it moves around is from this point. Yeah. So I guess you can do 360. Oh, it kind of stops. Well, I guess you could go to the other way around and I think that's the speaker. The mount goes in here and you twist it to mount it up. All right, so I got the Real Link app that I have actually registered um, everything. So I just need to press the um, press button and then it will automatically ask me to get the scan of the bottom. So let's do that. All right, so I need to set up the Wi-Fi. So I got the um, Wi-Fi name here. So let's type in the password. Okay, so that's registered and it says to scan my QR code to the camera. So, okay, let's do that. Scan succeeded. Oh, camera finally. Camera is connecting to your router. Please okay. wait. I have the voice next. Connection to the router succeeded. Yeah. Welcome to RealLink. Great, so it's been connected. So it's a bit tricky, but once you actually read the um, quick start it should all do the job so next so um connection to the router succeeded welcome to rio link nice look at that login password again okay let's try that connection to the router succeeded welcome to rio link name of your camera let's just call it um ljp tech and um Initiation can will finish. Okay, let's have look look at what's going on here. 
Right, so is this moving? Oh, okay. So, we got a bit of a camera here. Can we move it? Um, okay, drag the central button um, to control the PA, PTZ. Okay, nice, look at that. And um, I guess you could scroll up. Hello, that's me. Can you see that? <laughs> okay, so let's, what else do we have here? So, um, is that motion detection? Um, so we could talk, let's talk about, talk to tap. Allow. Hello. Hello. No. Hello. Hello. How are you? Okay, so you could adjust the volume as well on it. So let's do that and I think that's going to be pretty loud. Hello. 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 <laughs> okay. Oh, that's getting worse. Okay, so you could talk. You could actually get clips. Um, got it. So you could actually record some clips on it. So that's actually recorded. Um, and um, what else? And uh, you could, I just show you the PTZ and the playback button as well. So what we have here is I can actually um, get the sound, uh, take photos, um, also record. So I could save that onto my camera. So I think that's just um, four megapixels. Let's look at that. That's actually the one. Whoa, okay, that's really good quality. I can almost record um, my YouTube video on this one actually. I don't know whether you can see that. Let's just that is quite cool actually. Can you see that? That's impressive. So that's what they're mentioning about four megapixel high quality. It's um so that's a bit balanced. That's still good enough. Um but the way how it's slightly obviously because it has to go to the router and then come back. Uh, you can see a bit of a delay there, but it's good enough. Um, so I think you could do full screen as well. That's good. Um, let's do four megapixel on the full screen actually to show you what's going on. That is almost um, as clear as you can get. Yeah. Now, if we go to the um, gear sign here, there's the LJP Tech E1 Pro network, and there's the display. Um, if we click on display, there's like the rotation of the screen. So if you rotate the screen, you can actually look it upside down. Um, quality, I already actually set it up to uh, a good re resolution there. Anti-flicker, auto day and night, camera name. Uh, you can actually put those, um, whatever your preference. Date as well, you can prefer whatever you want. Watermark, privacy mask as well. So what's this privacy mask? So I guess you can drag in black uh, rectangle. Okay, so you can actually um, hide that around there. So I'll just cancel that just to show you what's going on. Um, do you want to, no, cancel. Um, so that's the, um, the gear, oh actually exposure. Let's try this advanced exposure. What is this, noise? Oh, this is the pic picture quality, smearing, manual, white balance, backlight. Let's do a bit of a backlight, shall we? Does that change? Oh yeah, cool, look at that. So you can actually adjust the, um, the light, 3D DNR. What's this? Um, let's do off and see what, if there's any difference there. Um, I don't know whether you can see the camera quality here. And off um, anyway and the other thing what we can do you can actually do push notification motion detection so I guess if someone makes a motion um, you could actually adjust the uh, the sensitivity of someone move and then it could automatically record because I believe there's a sensor on top of here this is quite high at the standard um, and motion zones I think you could actually adjust the uh, motion zones um, let's just cancel that and um, camera recording is on push notification and you can actually push notification as well for alert I guess 
uh, push for schedule email alerts. So some, this real link, because I'm registered under my email account, could send me emails, siren as well, I guess to warn some strangers, share a camera and etc. And lastly, we got these three dots, which is channel selection. I presume this LGP tech, you can get very various of cameras that you could actually put onto different channels. So you could go there, uh, done, um, but also day and night. So let's do black and white, shall we? And see how that looks like. Oh, look at that. Can you see those red lights? You can't see it on camera, but I can see it here. It's quite cool. So um, you get this almost like a day. Um, so night vision of the, uh, of the camera. Um, day and night. So let's just put it back to color. So you can hear a bit of a blink sound from the camera, actually, that's quite cool. Immersive. So what does this do? I have no idea, sorry. Um, there's immersive and picture in picture as well. So you can actually run this on the background to see while you actually um, run your show as well. Um, um, that's really good, actually. I'm really impressed with this. So there's a lot of function that I learned today of what a um, webcam could do. But um, there's so many things I, I hope I actually have shown, but that's all the things I could click off. But yeah, that's quite cool. Brilliant. I'm really looking forward to using this product. Um, and well done. Real um, link to recommend me this brilliant product. So I hope you liked it. If you have any further queries with regards to this product other than what I have shown, um, obviously there's time and data as well, which is good. So you could actually record it. So I'm really looking forward to using this actually. So thank you very much and I'll cherish it. But any feedbacks, any queries you want to make, please do comment or reach out to me. So thank you very much for watching this video. This is LJP Tech. All the best. Bye-bye.